morning crackers. Another whip update here. This is an eight foot long deer skin whip in black with a couple of tan accents. It is a twin belly whip with a uh, a bolstered core. So I put the core on, bolstered that, plaited a belly over that core, plaited a second belly over that belly, and then did this overlay. The core is on a 10 inch roofing spike. We've got a pineapple knot with a um, little two tone grapevine set up here. I don't know if you can see that. There's the black grapevine, there's the tan grapevine. Over one under one handle, diamond plating, gouching out at the transition, and then we've got a 14 plat overlay. Uh, I rolled this pretty tight, I plaited it quite tight. Tried to roll it even tighter and better. Put the overlay on once, realized it needed some work. So I took the entire overlay off, which let me tell you what, that's real fun. And then replatted it. So we went down the the uh, thong, I tapered the strands. So as I started to crowd up, I tapered them. I tried to drop as few as possible. So we're, we end up in an eight point hitch. I've got eight strands left. So I only dropped six of the strands through the plaiting process. I've got an eight point fall hitch there with eight strands coming through. Our nylon fall and then our polypropylene cracker. And counterweighted it. It's a really good whip. I say one of my best. Barely have to throw it to get any crack out of it. I know I've said this in all my other videos but it's really hard to get good cracks when I'm holding a camera. So I just throw really light things just to try and get a basic little pop out. Very lively, it's very stiff. I didn't do any binding. I, I bound the core and the first belly. Very light binding. All the stiffness that you're seeing in here is from the tight plaiting. And uh, I like it quite a bit. I'm quite pleased with this whip. Used to, uh, some leftover deer hide for the first belly, but then the second belly and the overlay were all constructed from one single hide. It's a kind of a smaller hide. It was maybe eight square feet or so. But uh, put it up for sale. There's a man out here with his dog. So I can't do too loud of a crack unless he's left. I don't see him. There you go. 14 plat, 8 foot, twin belly, bolstered core bull whip, and black deer skin on a 10 inch handle, 8 point fall tapered strands. I'll give you an idea of how these strands taper down. You can see the width there. I think these are probably right around seven millimeters. Uh, right around here we're talking maybe half that width. Around here we're talking even tinier, even tinier, even tinier. That's what they come out to. So if we compare these Probably gonna be tough to do, but I'll give it a whirl. Got uh, I guess you can't really tell much here, but this is also not stretched. So there you go. Put it up for sale at some point. Probably gonna put it up on eBay. Probably put a link on this video. And, uh, crack happy. Crack safe. Crack hard. Love you.